Mikasa, thank you again for helping me out. Of course, Commander. Um, one quick question. Can you just deliver these final documents to Levi? Of course. Do you know where I can find him? I think at this time of the day he should be in the library. And if he's not there, look up on Erwin's office. Oh, for sure. Thank you, Cadet. You're dismissed. Thank you, Commander. Excuse me. Okay, so I have these documents for Commander Erwin, and I have these other ones for Captain Levi, okay? Um, where can I find Captain Levi? Oh yeah, the library. Oh, hi. Dad, yes. How are you? I'm on my way to Levi's office. Yes, I know he doesn't like me to call him just Levi, but that's okay. And you? So you were on your way to Handy's office, I see. Um, I don't think she is on her office, actually. Because I had a few documents for her and she was not there. Now I'm looking for Captain Levi to give him his pile of documents. If you have time, and you don't mind me to ask, do you have plans for this afternoon? Yes. <laughs> That's okay. We can talk about it. But we're we're in the middle of the hallway. Can we perhaps just go outside? Perfect. This is a good place, actually. Right behind the window. I know. People who's walking on the hallway can still see us. But we are not disturbed in the way. You were talking about your day. How was that? Yes. The first part of our day goes to training. But what you did after that was my question. Oh, okay. So you were with Sasha all this time. How is she doing? I know that she was looking for the captain and I think, I think they have time right now. Yes, Sasha is completely in love with the captain. I'm glad you know that information. By the way, tomorrow afternoon, I'm free. And you should be too, because of our schedule. Would you... Oh, you have something on your face. Let me help you to clean that. Here, next to your eye. No, that's okay. Um, it's still here. It's kind of persistent. You know you have a very... Soft skin. And your eyes are so beautiful. That's okay, I just need to insist with this thing that you have next to your eye. Just one more second and it's gonna be... Mikasa! Commander Henji. What are you trying to do with my cadet? I was not... Not trying anything. They they should have something next to their eye. Really? Because I can't see anything. And I thought I asked you to look up for Captain Levi. That's what I was looking for, Commander. Cadet, what did you just say? Mikasa said I was not in my office. Well, because you were just there. And I ask you to look for Captain Levi. This is the last time I'm going to repeat myself, Cadet. I'm I'm sorry, Commander. 
I... I was not looking with any intention to your cadet. I, I was just... Mikasa, stop. I'm not asking you for you to apologize. I'm asking you to leave. Fine. I'm sorry, cadet. That was not my intention at all. Excuse me both. Mikasa. No, we'll have to talk to her later. And you? Why is it that you're not defending yourself? I know it's not like she was attacking you, but she was trying to touch your face. And every time that I try to touch your face, you get mad at me. What would you have done if I hadn't arrived on time? She was too near to you. And apparently, you were okay with it. Cadet, I really need to know your intentions with Mikasa and with me. Am I just a toy for you? Just a game? Is she something important? Then explain me right now. Why is it that you were spending time with her? I was not trying to make you feel that way, okay? I... Fuck. I know I'm overreacting, but I just... I'm not sure why, but I was on my way to another place and through the window. I was able to see you guys and she was way too near to your face and for some reason you looked like you were enjoying it and my body just moved and I opened that window and I just screamed. I know I... I know my reaction was not the best, and I'm sorry. But I just... I just felt like if I was about to lose you, and I'm not ready to lose you. I... I know and I can understand that my reaction right now might have been a little bit too much, and you might be scared of me. But I want you to be sure that you're safe in my arms. You're safe with me. I will work on it, I promise. But please give me another chance. Just don't... Don't judge me for what I just did. I... For some reason, I just... I felt like if I were blind... I was not thinking, and... I just react like an animal. Completely. Yes, of course, I can... I can apologize with Mikasa. Does that mean you're not mad at me? Oh, thanks goodness. Yes, for sure. I will... I will apologize to Mikasa right now. Right away. Cadet. I... I just... wanted to say I love you. I want you... to know it. I don't want you to forget about it, okay? Because I always love you. Thank you for this chance. Now I need to look up for Mikasa. And then I need to go back to what I was doing. And I have a lot of job for today. I know I haven't given you as many time as I wish, but yes, I know you always understand. But I just don't want you to understand. I want you to ask me for time. I want you I want you to let me know your wishes. I want you to force me to come out from my office. I I want you to visit me and give me kisses. I want you to do all those things. All the things that you want. Just do them. You deserve all my time and all my love. So please, do whatever you want to do. 
I love you, darling. I will see you later.